Daniel 12 wraps up the book with a strong message about the end times and the promise of resurrection. It's a chapter that gives us hope and reassurance that no matter how tough things get, there's a divine plan in place to bring us through. The chapter kicks off in verse 1 with a glimpse into a tough time ahead, but there's good news right from the start. Listen to what it says in verse 1. At that time, Michael the archangel who stands guard over your nation will arise. Then there will be a time of anguish greater than any since nations first came into existence. But at the time, every one of your people whose name is written in the book will be rescued. This is a promise that despite the chaos, those who are faithful are not forgotten. Daniel 12 doesn't just stop at delivering us from trouble. It speaks directly about life after death. It continues in verse two where it says, many of those whose bodies lie dead and buried will rise up, some to everlasting life and some to shame and everlasting disgrace. It's one of the clearest early mentions in the Bible of what happens after we die. Some will wake to eternal life and others, well, not so much. The chapter ends in verse 13 with a personal note to Daniel. It says, as for you, go your way until the end, you will rest. And then at the end of days, you will rise again to receive the inheritance set aside for you. It's like God is telling Daniel to keep on going, to stick it out because there's something better waiting at the end. Daniel 12 is more than just future predictions. It's about giving us the perspective we need right now. Knowing there's a resurrection and a promise of eternal life can change how we live today. It can give us the courage to face tough times and the hope to keep going. It's about sticking it out and staying faithful, knowing that what we do now matters for eternity.